little bit behind Mike is Jennifer Joe Cobb. You see Jennifer there. She got in a motorhome, Phil, in Kansas and drove here. Now, she stopped at camping and got her some stuff, but she said the wind bumping in that motorhome around, it made her feel like she was already at Talladega. It gave her a chance to get warmed up and ready to go race and hadn't been in a truck since Kansas earlier this year, looking to put something together to run the whole truck series, maybe some nationwide races in 2010. Today is all about learning and seeing if she can put that truck in a position to stay up in that lead pack. Thank you for all of the spotlights. In the field, making its way around Talladega Super Speedway. Crafton almost, oh, problems there for the 50. That is Jennifer Jo Cobb, and it looks like a engine has expired for her race truck. But we saw Matt Crafton make his way all the way up and almost challenging for the lead. Now he is mired all the way back in the 12th position. Same thing happened to Max Pappas on that first lap. He got a great run off turn two. Looked like he hesitated about which way to go with his move, and that's all it took for him to wind up in the middle of a mess and fall back through the field. Remember Terry Cook? Terry started in the outside of the front row. He came by last time in the 18th position. <laughs> Shocking for position on this racetrack is amazing, and right now, everyone's friend is that double yellow line to the left. A lot of smoke for Jennifer Joe Cobb's truck. She is going to appear to make it toward pit road. You see her to the right of your screen there. As long as she continues to roll, we will continue to stay green. If she would come to a stop on pit road or to the entrance to pit road, then NASCAR would have to throw the caution.